Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. We're taking a look at the 1 6 scale statue of Charlie Chaplin from A Dog's Life, made by Infinite Statue. Limited historical edition, old and rare by Infinite Statue. Officially licensed. And the piece comes with a beautiful diorama base. And the street light, which does light up. I was not expecting that but the piece itself from the image they're showing on the front of the box here looks absolutely spectacular. Go ahead, drop a like on the video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Now the back of the box features some amazing photography of the statue itself. Look at the effect of the rain going into the sewer drain there, the newspaper, the dog's paw on his shoe. Amazing. And you've got the light up LED street lamp, which requires batteries. I hope I have some batteries that are going to work in there. I don't know if I do, folks. I'll have a look. Some amazing photography here, though. And definitely pause this and have a read, folks, before we dig deep into this statue. It's conceived and realized in Italy. And there is the Infinite Statue website there. Definitely check them out. And officially licensed Charlie Chaplin product here. And there's the amazing talents involved in bringing this piece to us. Sculptor Dimitri Lepi, painter Dario Barbera, art direction Fabio Barotti, production manager Fabio Varesi. So really nice packaging as always from these guys. Wow, absolutely stunning. Some mild assembly required. Just basically put the head on Charlie Chaplin. You have to put his cane in his hand and you just plug the dog into the base, plug Chaplin into the base and plug the lamppost into the base. It's all just slots in. Unfortunately, folks, I do not have the batteries required to make the lamp light up. So I'm sorry about that, but they're a very specific small size battery and I just do not have any of those. But I can only imagine how amazing that would look with the lights off and nothing but the lamp illuminating the scene. Let's get a closer look at Charlie. What a head sculpt. Expression. Really well done. The sculpt on the clothing. Looks really, really nicely done too. So detailed. I love this effect of the rain. Or maybe, uh, I'm not sure if that is possibly the sewer kind of spilling out a little bit there, or I'm pretty sure it's rain. Look at the newspaper. That is really nicely detailed too. Beautiful base. This feels incredible as well. This shiny kind of reflective surface, obviously totally different to, you know, the ground and then the wet. Very smooth. Incredible. There's the dog. His little paw on the shoe. Amazing sculpt on this. Here is the underside of his base. The Infinite Statue website logo. The official Charlie Chaplin details, limited edition. Uh, my one is not numbered, but there are 500 pieces in the world. And here is 
the actual Charlie Chaplin statue. Very, you know, quite a lot of weight to him. He's a solid, you know, statue piece here, so. Really, really impressive. Wow, that angle there is perfect. Look at the hair as well. Let's get a closer look at the dog. Really well sculpted. His face. And the paws as well. Even though you're not going to see them. They painted them right. That's awesome. His little dog back. He's so cute. Cute doggy. And Charlie's cane. Very nicely done. And you get a beautiful certificate of authenticity. Really nice thick card. Pause that and have a read, folks. I really like this kind of side view for some reason, but it's too heavy to turn on my rotating base, but I can put it on the rotating base and just turn it manually. So, I'll just let you see the angles here. Oh, I forgot to put his cane back in his hand. Where is it? Here it is. Give him back his cane. All right, he is complete again. Just amazing from any angle. Look at the way the light's catching his eyes there. Looks very real. This is a classy piece. This is something that you can have in an office or even a living room. Just really eye-catching, classy looking, very classy. Very tasteful. Just a beautiful effect of that water. Cannot stress enough. I mean, that's something you really have to see in person. It is absolutely stunning. Beautiful effect. What do we have here? Revolution. Price for liberty. Staining here. The newspaper. You can read all of that. Let me just zoom in. in detail up on the clothing so that you see the detail in the sculpt and the buttons and the various rips and tears in his vest <laughs> his eyebrows very very cool uh, I love it excellent excellent piece So there you go, you've got your on-off switch and then you just, looks like it needs about three of those pretty small chunky batteries. I'm not sure what the model number for those batteries would be, but yeah, I'm sure if you go onto the website, www.infinitestatue.com, it should tell you. I wish there were some batteries in there that I could have shown you the street lamp lit up. But unfortunately they were not in my box and I do not have any at this time. But I can only imagine how cool it would look with the street lamp illuminated. This is an absolute masterpiece though. Another beautiful statue from Infinite Statue. Amazing work. A true tribute to Charlie Chaplin. 
and the dog from a dog's life. Give it a 10 out of 10. Again, no reason not to. Unless you want to get really fiddly about the battery situation, but I, I just think it's silly to knock away points for something like that. I think the statue is incredible. The base is incredible. The sculpt, the pose, the life. Absolutely amazing work. 10 out of 10, once again. Let me know what you think in the comments, folks. Check out their website at www.infinitestatue.com. Drop a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, follow me on Instagram at Dean Knight Free Free, because I'll be posting some pictures on there for you to check out. Thanks for watching, folks. See you soon. Take it easy. Bye bye.